Welcome to Visible, the complete virtual reality collaboration and creation tool for professionals. This video will introduce you to the core features of Visible and help you get acquainted with the Visible dashboard, presentation designer, and the Visible presenter and attendee tools. It will also show you how to host and join Visible VR meetings, which we call sessions. Please follow along with the actions on screen and pause when necessary in order to take full advantage of this introductory tutorial. Let's start by getting familiarized with the Visible dashboard. This is your web-based portal and Visible organizational hub. Here, you can invite and manage users, download the latest versions of the desktop applications, access our documentation, and submit and receive support and feedback directly with the WorldBiz team. You can also download sample assets to get you started with Visible and chat with our support team directly. Please start by downloading the latest versions of Presentation Designer and the client on the downloads page. The client download contains both the visible presenter and visible attendee applications. Presentation Designer is your drag and drop content creation platform for visible where you create VR scenes and schedule VR sessions. Visible Presenter and Visible Attendee are your virtual meeting applications where you can join scheduled VR sessions. First, we will look at Presentation Designer, as you need to create a presentation here before you can host or join a multi-user VR session. It may take a few minutes for the applications to download and unpack. Once installed successfully, go ahead and log in with your organization credentials. When you first log into Presentation Designer, you will be greeted with the following screen, where you have the option to choose between Launcher and Assets. Launcher is your launchpad for new and saved visible VR presentations and experiences, while Assets contains all of your uploaded visible props, including 3D models, videos, PDFs, and more. This cloud-based asset library is accessible and shared with all visible users within your organization. Please navigate to the Launcher and then select New Scenes up at the top left. In addition to the standard blank scene option, which lets you create a new scene from scratch, there are several template scenes that WorldBiz has provided to give you a starting point for getting acquainted with Visible. You can download a template scene by double-clicking on the scene. With these template scenes, you have the option to create and join a new session to experience a fully formed Visible presentation right out of the box. If you would like to create your own new Visible scene, we recommend downloading one of our asset packages from the Visible dashboard and following along with our detailed tutorials to get better acquainted with content creation in Presentation Designer. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will download a template scene. I'm going to select this proximity sensor scene. Once you have created or loaded a scene that you want to experience in VR, select the Sessions tab in the bottom left-hand corner. You will need to create a new session by clicking the plus button in the upper left-hand corner of the Sessions tab. This will open up the scheduling window. Set the date and time you would like to have your meeting and give your meeting a name. The date and time are automatically populated to meet now, so I don't need to change those. Once finished, click Add Session. If you would like to invite other people to join your VR session, right-click on the session and copy the invitation text. You can email this text to your intended audience, and it includes the session ID and a download link for the visible attendee application, which they will need to join. I'm going to send this invitation to my colleague Dan so he can join me in VR.
Now, you will need to open up the visible presenter application. Go ahead and copy and paste the session ID from the sessions tab of Presentation Designer. Then find the presenter application and open it up. Note that you and your attendees can join a visible session using an HTC Vive, Oculus Rift with touch controllers, PC, or WorldViz PPT system. Visible is hardware agnostic, so users with different hardware setups can join the same session, and you don't need them all to be on the same type of device. As presenter, you will enter your session ID, which I'm going to paste in there, and then your credentials. Go ahead and add your nickname, which will appear above your avatar in the session. A presenter will always have to join a session first before attendees can join. Notice that attendees do not need login credentials to join a visible session, making it easy to invite people outside of your visible organization to join you in VR. All users will need to download the assets in the session before joining. This can be done prior to the meeting by selecting the Download Assets button, which will appear here for those that open up the attendee client and put in your session ID. Always make sure you have your volume turned up and microphone enabled before joining a visible session. If you are joining with the Vive, ensure your controllers are turned on prior to joining the session. Now that we've filled out all the info, we can sign in to our visible session. It'll take a few seconds to load up. Now, as you can see, we're inside the presentation that we created in the Visible Presentation Designer. Once you're invisible, you can access a number of tools. You click the Menu button on your wrist, and this pulls up an array of different tools. You have things like laser pointers, pencils, and more. As you can see, Dan has just joined our scene and I can hear his voice through my headphones. Now in this scene, I actually want to use my magic carpet tool to navigate into this proximity sensor. As you can see, this caused the HMD to rise and rotate. In Presentation Designer, you can configure these proximity sensors to do a wide array of different things, from animating objects to transitioning between different slides. You can also use the remote tool to point it at playable media like sounds, videos, or spherical videos and trigger them to play. So there you have it. We've gone from our visible dashboard on the web to the presentation designer where we created this presentation, and then finally to visible where we started a session with Dan and had a multi-user visible experience. We encourage you to check out our other tutorials where you can see more in depth how to create your own visible presentations and do more advanced things with the presentation designer tool. If you'd like to then have a session with us where we meet you inside your presentation to show it off, we'd love to do that. Okay, so thanks for checking out this video and we look forward to seeing what you create. Bye Dan.